question number 38 it reads x is due east of y on a cost z is another point on the cost but six kilometer due south of y if the distance zx is 12 kilometers we ask to calculate the bearing of uh, z from x so let's break the question down remember our four cardinal points we have the north the south the east and the west so let's start with x suppose we have a point x here do east of y okay so we have to start with y so if we have y here do east of y we are going to this direction and we have to meet x at that point right z is another point on the coast but six kilometers uh, due south of y so this is the south of y if you come down here you have to meet z and this is six kilometers from the question so the distance of z to x so we are going to connect z and x together they said is 12 kilometers the question is asking us to calculate the bearing of z from x so this is the z and we want to calculate the bearing from x so let me show you how to calculate the bearing from x if we have our cardinal points like this you know at the back right here we have 180 degrees so we don't have problem with this this is 180 degrees so we need this angle right here whatever angle is here we add it to 180 degrees that will give us uh, the bearing of z from x because we want to find that angle that goes from the north of x down to the line leading to z so if we can find this angle right here we are halfway done remember this is a right angle triangle so this angle right here let us find it sine theta is opposite all of our hypotenuse so let's use that sine theta is equal to opposite and the opposite of theta is 6 and the hypotenuse the longest side is 12 and sine theta is equal to 1 over 2 or 0 0.5 if sine theta is 0 0.5 it means that theta is equal to sine inverse of 0 0.5 just use your calculator and that will give us 30 degrees so theta is equal to 30 degrees so if this angle right here is 30 degrees if this is 30 degrees remember that this is south and this line here is 90 degrees if you come down from here down here you have 180 plus another 90 making 270 and out of this 270 we want to take away 30 just to get the angle that stopped at this point so to find this bearing we are going to take away 30 from 270 and that will give us 240 degrees which is option A.